Hi guys, it's Maggie. It's New York Fashion Week. We are behind the scenes uh, with at Georgine with Antonio Corral Calero, one of my all-time favorite people in the world. I just love, love, love him from Moroccan Oil. So I'm going to flip this around so you can see what he's doing. He's doing three pretty cool looks, uh, and he's going to whip up one of these. And, and he's using dry texture spray, and I can tell you, it's smelling pretty good. So I'm flipping. So Antonio, yeah. you are. It's so good to see you. Thank you. The same here. <laughs> Thank you for coming backstage uh, for Georgine. Um, so I'm just showing you. We're doing a very uh, soft bun. We do three different looks this season with the models, and uh, we're going from uh, um, very pretty, pretty half down, half up, half down, to a bun on the side, to a very sleek, uh, uh, tight ponytail with a little twist in the back. So the transition is from a girl that she's in the ferry, in the in the uh, in the um, forest, and she's walking around, and her hair got caught into the trees and it's kind of like a pretty but yet very effortless look so uh, the band that we're doing it we actually using the dry texture spray we apply it through the entire hair this is a new product that we launched not too long ago and it really does wonders into the hair because it can make hair to be very limpy to be very uh, grip grippy to it and with texture without weighing it down or without feeling that you have any product and the look works amazing because actually we're doing everything pretty much with our fingers so we're gonna be bringing the hair. It's not powder, right? Or is it no, it's not powdery right? at all. That's the beauty of it. Um, so we're using our fingers just to bring the hair to the left side. Oops, sorry. We wanted to look kind of like she did it herself, in a way. How do you determine which model is going to get the effortless look or uh, the very severe? Depending on what the look is going to be with them, we do one look or the other one. Uh, and also depending on the features. I think the importance over here is that we make their looks, we make the models look the best. So sometimes if they got certain type of features and the hair looks better down, we also have a one look that the girls are going to be just with the hair down. Uh, somebody was asking what kind of brush that is, the polishing brush that okay. you use. You should definitely get that polishing brush. It has a different levels uh, on the, the boards and uh, it could work for you to comb the hair but also if you want some of this, you know, some of use it in some of the areas that you don't want to put the whole brush, you're just going with the tip. And where's that bond? Who's that bond? Moroccan oil. Oh, it's a Moroccan oil? Yeah. Oh, it's a Moroccan oil tea. Moroccan oil, yes. yeah. All right, look at that. <laughs> yeah. That. Well, Moroccan oil, we're very in right I was now. I it was going to be a different answer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I would have lied to you. <laughs> I know you would. I would have said some other story. But you see, it's quite effortless. We don't want it to be too pretty. And I think for people that they've seen that the looks this season is about, has to look like you did it yourself not anymore about looks being too well done or too perfect i think you keep a certain use to it and a certain uh, um, easiness and then you can really go a bit more crazy with your clothing and then on the flip side then you have a very severe look right next to it yes so that describes a bit more like the witch the bad girl of the group so we just uh, we make it to be the opposite of here it's very sleek very clean uh, and I'm sure that Amy can tell you a little bit about it. What did you use, Amy, for? Uh, I'm, I'm coming over to you. Hey, okay, hi. You. And I'm coming back to you in a minute. Great. All right. So, inside, you have it. I don't want to grab so this is very <laughs> severe, sleek, shiny. How do you get it so shiny? So we're working with our heat styling protection. Cool. And we've really lacquered it into the root area, probably three quarter way of, down of the hair, and really just combed the hair flat to the head. We're not going with any volume, really, really sleek. We went over uh, not just with a tail comb, but then with the same smoothing, teasing brush that Antonio was using just to really finish and get a little bit more perfection to the look. We're doing a very tight, tight ponytail in the nape. We're using some elastic thread for that to keep it really, really tight and secure. And then we're just gonna be creating a little bit of a twisted knot. 
Again, very smooth, very sleek, very lacquered. We're working with mostly the heat styling protection, some of our Glimmer Shine Spray, because we love it, and uh, of course the Luminous Hairspray Medium. So, and somebody's, what's the name of the knot? The, the it's a twisted knot. I'm just going to uh, simplify it that way. It's a ponytail first at the nape, really tight and secure. As you can see, the perfection of the ponytail probably takes the longest than anything. Yeah. And then it's just to twist up the and hair very to a knot. Center part. Very strong, very severe center part. No volume in there. And really just following as well the natural hairline of each model so that they have a little bit of individuality as well. So we're really just keeping it nice and sleek on the hairline, tucking those little hairs in front of the air, we want to kind of pull those in as tight as possible as we can and keep that. Violet's done a pretty good job at that. I mean, I'm a bit of a perfectionist. She, she lives for that. <laughs> OCD goes a long way at Fashion Week. <laughs> it's very interesting that it's three people to do this one head of hair. Oh, yeah. It takes a village, right? It takes Antonio. a village. Here we go, Ames. All right, so I'm going to go back over to this, to this little knot over here. Let's just this little knot. Here's, here's the finish knot. The finish knot. Cool. All right. And where is the, the finish? Yeah, this, is, uh, this is we have to redo it. I didn't see that look. We have to redo that look. Okay. Uh, Emmy or Violet, you want to go through a little bit that look, please? This? this? Okay. Just come next to uh, talk about what it is. and talk about the look. What did we do? What did we put? Yeah, well, I finish here. It's beautiful. Yeah, and I'll get out of your way. And the texture and everything. Yeah. Just yeah. through the whole. Bag. So we've actually we've just launched the texture collection in the United States. So this look is done entirely with those products. We started with the dry texture spray, and we've actually just sprayed that throughout the hair, and then used the curling iron to really stretch a little bit of that natural texture out, but keep it really natural. And um, we've then just really loosely scraped it with our fingers it's a very visual type of effect um, something quite wearable scooped it into a low uh, pony through the occipital bone there and then clipped in the little ribbon perfection and we, and we did a little you remember that we did a little a little a little twist over there so just through the front here through the front area, we've actually just taken a little piece of hair on the left side and pinned it with a little bobby pin. So it's a little sort of, I guess you could say, a little off center with that little area yeah. there. So what's the deal? Do you have to have a cool accent to work on this? Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, just for people that you're watching out there, if you have an amazing accent and you come from different country, come to see Robert Ham that is in the back. Robert Ham and that's Robert Ham.com. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, really, if somebody wants to get on the Moroccan oil team. They can definitely visit our website at moroccanoil.com under careers and uh, submit a web to submit the resume and it will come to the right place. Do you accept like a Brooklyn accent? We <laughs> sure do. You've got so Southern, you Barcelona, <laughs> Trinidad and Australia. Let me tell you guys, do we have a good time in Fashion Week? <laughs> Great way to end. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.